needing to win this game. And even if we win, it's not totally guaranteed that we'll make a ball game. But we won the toss. We're kicking so we can get the ball in the second half. But, yeah, our game last week was almost flawless. I mean, not too much went bad, except we did give up a pick six on a uh, late throw that was really bad because I forced it. Um, we ended up getting our first uh, punt return for a touchdown in the series. Or at least I'm pretty sure it was our first. On, so, and there's a reverse, I think, or it was just a wide receiver sweep play. So second down and seven for Navy. Uh, Navy's gonna run a lot on us, I think. Maybe not. Maybe they won't play it totally conventional themselves either. <laughs> so, we're going to fire in there and, and see if we can, looks like they're going to be heavy in the run, and they are running, and I'm the one that actually gets the stop, and they will punch the ball away. Okay, they're down and on. And there is a flag, but so so we got the fumble recovery, and there's a holding call on Navy that will be declined, and we will get the ball on the turnover. So we got the fumble recovery, so we got the football. So first down to ten. And we got a couple. Second and eight coming up here. Ball the Second and eight. Still up seven, nothing. And we're gonna get a couple yards there. We are two for three on third down. And that's caught by 30. And we get, I think it's a, the, yeah. Okay, so, yeah. going to say inside the 30, but we're actually inside the 25. So first down is that from the 23. And overthrow. Uh, he just couldn't get to that one. Well, he looked to be a little excited back there in the pocket. May have rushed things a little bit. Needs to be a little bit more patient. Step up and make the throw. Number 30 is the single setback. They go with the option. Elateral. Okay. That probably should not have worked. Because I ended up with the quarterback getting hung out behind, but it worked. We got a first down. It's now first down and goal. And we're going to get a couple yards on that run from number 30. Uh, I'll try that. So, it's a play action. Pass is going to probably go to 30. If I, or not. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like this. We got all day, but I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. I still don't like it. I can, I got all day. Nobody's coming to get me. No one's helping me. And I don't know where that ball was thrown. We were trying to get it. To, I thought it was 30 that was down here. Okay, so we had all day to throw just to... You know, I don't know if that was thrown or 
you know, dropped by a defender or dropped by, why am I running? I don't know. So, we're going to audible out of the run. Navy Go with this throw. And yet again, I got all day. So, no, I don't have all day. Okay, I can't throw. Uh, I wanted to, okay, I didn't really have all day like I thought. We'll kick the field goal and hopefully make it, but I did have a lot of time there too. I just couldn't do anything with it, with all that time on either play. I'm hoping I got this right, I don't know. And I do, angles are, you know, a problem, plus. I'm not always accurate with the kick, that's why I miss field goals. But we make it, we're up to nothing. For more than that, but it's okay. As Reese does get the catch, and we. Oh! Reese is, uh. Okay. That was a record by Reese, as we're going to call him out. And it looks like Reese got hurt! So, he's got our receiving record now, with just under a thousand yards this season. First and ten, ball on the 34 yard line. Army comes out of the shotgun, they'll throw on first down, rolls right. And going over the top, trying to, or at least trying to go over the top of the defender, but he was able to get his hand on it. And Reese is out for the rest of the game because he bruised his knee. So we tried to get the ball to 17. Who? Uh, there. To replace. It's third down at ten. This is the fifth play. Of oh, the Reese there. So. The midshipman line up in a nickel back. He drops back. Looking. Steps up. Going deep. Going. And number eleven comes away with it. Holy cow! I did not. Think. I was not thinking we were going to get that. But number eleven does make that catch. And he got out of bounds, which doesn't really do much. No, it's just. So, uh, the next play, we run number 30 on a dive, and he runs it in for the touchdown. Like, you know, our last game against Houston, this game against Navy, we are running away with it, which is good, because that just makes our chances better to possibly make a ball game. So we'll be back with the second. And Lester should have it right there. Got the first down. I'll tell you what, Brad, that is very close. I didn't think he was going to make it there, Coach. Kirk, I agree with you 100%. I thought he was stop short, too. This kid shows some First down and 10. On that one. Navy brings in the nickel here. They'll throw on first down. Rolls to the oh, boy. Here we go again. Or and that one somehow was caught by number 30. I was really nervous because number 30 seemed to keep going back further and further deeper into the end zone. That, okay, we're gonna. That one was gonna get picked, but it wasn't. As number 30 did come back to the ball and make the catch. As the direct snap to number 30. It's number 30, uh, second touchdown of the game. Okay, first down and 10. And trying to get to the outside, but they had a defender waiting, so we only got here. Okay. We didn't get any more. Got another yard. It's third down and eight to go. 
Third down and eight. He's going to be a 38 out for us. And Kennard makes the catch. <laughs> yeah, our offensive line is being awesome today. We have all day to throw the ball when we want to throw. We don't usually get that. We don't usually, I mean, every once in a while we'll have, but it's like almost every time I go to throw, we have a lot of time to throw the ball. Our offensive of line, they are doing an excellent job protecting our quarterback and giving them enough time to get the ball out, even if it's not that great of a pass. Now let's give it to Duckett, uh, go line. There's the Duckett. See if he can get the third and inches completed here. And he does. See what we could do on the option. A light pitch. We're going to get a couple yards. Um, okay. And it'll be a four yard option. Not bad. Well, we're about two minutes left of the, until the end of the game. Twenty-eight. Couldn't get it. So third down. So we'll see. Gonna run it again. Cause you know if we do get. Well, we're gonna get the touchdown instead. But yeah, if we we're gonna get the field goal, I was gonna or. If we got the first down, I was just going to take the knees. Okay. But we got the touchdown. So we're going to win this one. Big weeks when we have our first game for season four. I will have that. But let's uh go and, you know, simulate through what I need to to find out if we're going to be in a bowl game or not. So a couple touchdowns for 30. Lester had almost 200 yards passing and Reese had the opening touchdown for our team and then got hurt. Uh, saving my EA bio um, and then save some more. Uh, some championship games to simulate uh, from a couple conferences. We got the MAC, the Big 12, and the SEC. Now we got to sim through. Um, but yeah, I think after that there'll there'll be an indication. Sim through the week. And so, uh, Northern Illinois won, Texas won, and I think that said Tennessee won. So, uh, we did get a, an award. Our first award of the season goes to Hunt. Hunt wins the Jim Thor Trophy. I'm not exactly sure what that does, or what that's for exactly. And Hunt also won the uh, be, the Chuck Bedark Award. And Minnesota Halfback is the Heisman Trophy winner. Beating out TCU's Halfback. And yes! We are going to be in the GMAC Bowl. 
against the nine and three Toledo Rockets out of the MAC conference. So that will be our next game. Everybody have a good day. Bye.